you're here yet. It still feels kind of crazy. Has this transition just been seamless for you, or are there moments where it's surreal or even a little weird? Uh, yeah, I, I've have a lot of had a lot of emotions. You know, um, and change for anybody is is uh, definitely difficult early on. But I'm looking forward to taking that head on and just learning as much as I can and uh, being a part of this great organization. What are the emotions you're going through right now? Just I'm used to a routine, and uh, when it changed up, it's just it's a little different for me. So, but like I said, I'm excited taking on this new challenge and. You know, I can't wait to start. This is an important time for you with training camp. How do you balance wanting to be yourself, wanting to be assertive, but also not stepping on toes and listening and learning? Well, I was always raised to be aggressive and be who I am every single day. And, um, you know, so I, I saw, that's all I can do. That's all I can control. And, uh, you know, and I try to be, you know, try to be the best teammate I can be, man. That's just, that's just who I am. That's what I stand on. And, you know, I know, I know it'll come in. I'll come in and leave my mark with this team. Speaking of teammates, this isn't your first time teaming up with a dominant guard. You've already played with Russell Westbrook. How might that be different or similar to playing with Stephen Curry? I think it's different because they have different games, um, but they're both uh, really, really great point guards. So, you know, uh, just having someone like, you know, playing with Russell for so long and then coming over to playing with Steph, I think, uh, you know, it's going to be an easier transition for me than what people think. Uh, but it's just a matter of me getting the system down, the schemes, terms, all that different stuff. So we'll see how it works. People talk about ball in hands, touches. Does that matter as much, especially with the way the Warriors play and move the ball? Uh, it matters, obviously. You know, you want you know get the ball in, um, into good positions and get good shots. And I think that's what this team does better than anyone is find a great shot. And uh, the ball dictates who, who uh, the game dictates who gets the ball. And, so it should be fun, man. I'm looking forward to it. Okay, I know you know Coach Adams already. He's already said he has big expectations for you on defense. Where do you think you fit in, especially with a team that likes versatility and being able to switch? Oh, just being a guy that has been the uh, last three or four years, I've uh, been trusted to guard every position. So I have to bring it to this team. You know, they do a lot of switching um, in, in a lot of different situations, so i got to be ready. And I'm excited for it. I've been doing it for a while now. The NFL and also the WNBA has been on the forefronts for talking about social change, race, racial change, uh, politics, even anthem protests. Yeah. How do you expect NBA players to take their own protest this year or th use the platform? Uh, that's uh, that's uh, you know that's one thing we gotta you gotta wait and see. You know I'm sure we have a lot of guys with with strong voices in this league and that uh, you know really against uh, social injustice and you know I think it's great that we're just having this conversation about it. So. That's the main goal is just, you know, take the focus off of how we're protesting and, and, and turn it to what we're protesting about. So, you know, I'm, uh, I'm excited about what's going on in our country and, and, the, and the movement, uh, you know, that Mr. Kaepernick has started and, and uh, how it's taking legs. So, you know, uh, we'll, we'll see what happens. All right. Thanks, Katie. All right. Good to see you. Thank you. Hope to see KD. That point was for me, by the way. That's it's for you. Yeah, because he knew we were here on the other side. Yes watching them. <laughs> uh, back at you, Katie. We'll see the Warriors and the Raptors uh, first preseason game Saturday right here on NBA TV. 7 Eastern time. Coverage starts with the Auto Trader pregame show.